Hello, it's me, your resident lactose intolerant. Um, I decided to buy this at the grocery store today. I went to Trader Joe's um, and just, I just couldn't resist. I haven't been to Trader Joe's since they launched this or I've just walked past the ice cream aisle, like don't look, don't look. But you guys have been really liking my reviews lately on my stories. So um, here we are, here we are again. Um, this is the vanilla non-dairy frozen dessert from Trader Joe's. Again, it's relatively new, made with almonds, um, 24 grams of sugar, Ooh, it's not even in the whole container that's per serving. Whatever. Who cares? I don't care. I took off the little peely thing. Also, I am on the floor. I didn't feel like setting anything up, getting fancy with it. So we're on the floor in front of a window. You're welcome. It's been out of the freezer for like three, four minutes. Pretty soft already, which love to see it. Now the Trader Joe's non-dairy chocolate is one of my favorites. This has got, it's got a lot to live up to. But the guy at the checkout counter was like, literally pointed out when this is really good. He didn't sound like that. I don't know why I did that. Okay. Wow. That's pretty impressive. That that's actually pretty impressive. Wow, I'm floored. I did not think this was gonna taste good at all. And this tastes pretty good. I'm blown away. I am like, I am actually blown away. So much so that I can't talk, wow. I can't taste the almond. Like it doesn't taste like the non-dairy base. It tastes like vanilla. It doesn't taste like ac actual shit, which some dairy fried ice creams taste like. This is, this is a decent vanilla. Wow. When I usually get ice cream, like if I'm really in an ice cream mood, I rarely get just a plain flavor. Like I rarely get plain vanilla or plain chocolate. <laughs> Or plain strawberry like I did last week but like this fucks this ice cream fucks I am I am shaken I, I know that that's all I can say the texture is good it's not too icy it's not too hard or weird it's like a decent texture and like, it doesn't taste exactly like vanilla ice cream, like Haagen-Dazs or anything like that, but it doesn't taste vegan. And that is the craziest part. Actually, let me just double check it's vegan. It's definitely obviously dairy-free, but mm. I don't know. I'm supposed to say vegan. It doesn't taste dairy-free. This is like, this is like really decent. You could give this to me and I, 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 I would think like, this was just like not the best vanilla I've ever had, but made of milk. I'm gonna keep eating this. Guys, Trader Joe's, Trader Joe's kills it. Trader Joe's kills it. Wow. This is gross. <laughs> Wow. I think this is getting like a four and a half. Maybe like a 4.3. Like if the Trader Joe's chocolate, I'm gonna give it a four and a half. I know I haven't done a review on it, but I fucking love the Trader Joe's chocolate ice cream. That's a four and a half. This is a 4.3, solid choice. Like, if you like vanilla ice cream and you can't have dairy, this is a solid, solid choice. All right, it's dinner time for me. Bye.
<laughs> that is so gross. All right. My mom taught me not to talk with my mouth full. Sorry, mom.